Hey, good morning, guys. Now, that child is still at Stroger Hospital in critical condition. He had surgery yesterday, but they have now sedated that child. In the meantime, we've seen political leaders as well as community activists coming out here to the same corner where that child was shot, trying to curb the violence. Right now, a four-year-old boy is fighting for his life after he was shot on the west side in broad daylight. Police are saying it was around 345 Monday afternoon when the shooting took place near the corner of Kedzie and North Avenue in the Humble Park neighborhood. This is just crazy. I mean, I don't understand why guns are still as available as are right now. We spoke to the grandmother of the child Monday evening off camera. She told us they were headed to get the four-year-old boy a treat like an icy. That's when a bullet came through the back of her vehicle, hitting the boy in his back and exiting through his stomach. He was eventually taken to Georgia Hospital where he's undergone surgery, still in critical condition. He was a four-year-old kid and he deserves to live. He deserves to live a full life without trauma. All the person Jesse Fuentes was at the same corner in her 26 ward. She's teamed up with the violence prevention organizations canvassing the area, trying to encourage change. We want to be able to talk to business owners and residents, provide transparency on the uh, nature of the events where we are at today um, in collaboration with CPD and our violence prevention organizations. Her team has been in contact with the family and as that four year old fights for his life, all the person Jesse Fuentes says she's fighting to bring an end to the violence plaguing Chicago streets. We can't keep utilizing violence um, as a way to resolve problems. And so I beg, I beg the suspects uh, to, to stand down, to turn themselves in, uh, because that young boy deserves a long life. And again, that child is still in critical condition. In the meantime, police are asking for your help. If you have any information that can help lead to an arrest in this shooting, I want you to contact them immediately. For now, we're live here in Humble Park on Glen Marshall, WGN News.